Well, polls open throughout Ohio tomorrow morning at 630 for the primary election. Also happening tomorrow will be rain most of the day. Coming up in just four minutes, Chief Meteorologist Dave Mazza tracking a few storms, some that could be severe. To cast a ballot in person tomorrow, voters will need identification, like a driver's license, state ID, or a utility bill. A spokesperson with the Franklin County Board of Elections says about 2.7% of the county's registered voters either voted in person, turned in their mail-in ballot, or requested one. And tonight, NBC4's Ari Kalperin is at a polling location with an inside look at what goes into making sure everything is up and running in time for you tomorrow morning. Eric? Colleen, we're at the Whetstone Community Center. It is one of 320 polling locations that'll be open in Franklin County tomorrow. And a lot of the work to make sure everything runs smoothly tomorrow morning was done tonight. Thank you so much, Ms. Amy, for giving us a call back and let us know. You're looking at what the Franklin County Board of Elections calls its war room. Employees taking calls from poll workers as they set up their polling locations. They're setting up locations, they're setting up the machines, they're setting up the roster tables, they're putting out the signs, they're getting the location prepped and ready to go in anticipation for voting at 6.30 a.m. on Tuesday morning. Anton White is the director of the Franklin County Board of Elections, watching as locations update saying they're good to go. You guys get set up and um, be solid for election day tomorrow. The war room takes calls on election eve as polling locations get ready and through election day. The call takers running the hotline answer any questions and help with any problems poll workers might run into. This room will take thousands of calls, but it's okay. You know, we're here, we're here for our poll workers, we're here for our voters. Franklin County polling locations haven't always gotten prepared the night before. According to the Board of Elections, a few started doing that in 2019, and this is the third election where all 320 locations have been set up election eve. There's nothing more important than being ready to go at 6.30 a.m. on Tuesday morning. So setting up the night before just allows us that extra time to do that. And the Franklin County Board of Elections says they've been recruiting poll workers for the last couple of weeks, and White says he is confident they have enough. Local for you in Columbus, I'm Eric Halperin, NBC4.